Welcome to the fair. The hand in hand fair is an all abilities fair. It's a lot of fun and there's so many activities to do. Have a great time today and have a great day. Mwah. is an after-school inclusion program that pairs teens and young adults with special needs with their same age typical peers for an afternoon of fun activities. It's really for socialization more than anything else. That's an opportunity that a lot of these young people don't have. As the mother of a 26-year-old daughter with special needs, I know most kids with, with special needs end up spending a lot of their time with their parents or caregivers. We meet every Thursday from 4 to 5.30 just to make friendships and hang out and talk and do art and yoga and cook and just be together and build these relationships. And we have lots of field trips and we go to Disneyland, we come to the beach. One of the other components that's really wonderful is we do do community service projects and activities, whether it's providing blankets for kids in hospitals or in foster homes. We feel that it's really important for all of our kids to be able to give back to their community. Every time they meet, we try to make a celebration of life, and that's what it should be. The fair is, I think, one of my favorite things because it's about inviting the entire community to play together and to interact together. We wanted to create this wonderful fair opportunity with inclusive art activities. Everything is accessible for people with all abilities. All of our carnival games were adapted, so if we had a fishing game, we might have long poles. So again, if you were in a wheelchair, you could have access to that game. We have a stage where people perform all the time and we have different companies integrated wheelchair dance and choirs and singers and at the same time we have different booths. And then we have ponies that are used for equine therapy that kids could paint and pet and, and interact with. And in the end, to me, it felt like how every community event should be. We're really proud to sponsor Hand in Hand. This is the second year. And I think last year's event, we couldn't believe how many people showed up for that. And this year, I think we have 200 people at least. I'm so proud to be able to represent the city at an event like this and to show the city support, but also my personal support. The Jewish Federation is very proud of everything that's going on in the Malibu community. For families with children with special needs, it's really easy to feel invisible. It, it's really easy to see people doing a lot of things in the community and they're not being anything for their child or, or their loved one. And a day like this helps us celebrate everybody's ability and it's letting people and the neurotypical people know that there is a place for everybody. You don't have to be, you know, the, the perfect body to dance. Everybody can dance. Everybody can sing. You can really do anything and be anything with the right support. And it's with the help of organizations like Hand in Hand. We are Infinite Flow, a wheelchair dance company, and we are very excited to be here at the Hand in Hand Festival. One of the best things about Hand in Hand is seeing that everybody is capable of doing anything they want. And I think coming together and seeing that is a really great reminder. And it's also super fun. I think that it's wonderful. It gives children an experience to do many different things and be open to many different things as well. I had a lot of fun today. Oh boy, I've been having such a wonderful time with the children and other special needs adults because I have autism and I don't always fit in, but in an environment like this, I definitely met my people. I have had a fantastic time! Woo! <laughs> yes, we had a great time. I came with my mother and actually my 90-year-old grandmother as well, so they're out there dancing on the floor when we got ready to like, you know, learn how to dance. 
is also for the families that they may not have somebody with special needs, but to celebrate inclusion, to celebrate inclusion that we are all one. Our differences aren't really so different. Everyone can come together and like be friends no matter what we have is different about us. Color, walk, not walk, talk, not talk. Everyone has the right to enjoy life. The most important part of our community as, as, as a reconstructionist is to, is to make sure that there's room for everyone. I'm also the mother of an 18-year-old autistic son who is a talented, wonderful, beautiful person who has so much to give. And I think we would all learn so much from having more Davids <laughs> in the community with us. Hand in Hand has been successful because we had the support of everybody. It's a group effort, so we still need support. Deep down inside, we are all the same. We all want the same things. We want friends. We want to have fun social opportunities. We want to do things with our peers. We don't want people to see our disabilities, but we want people to see um, us. It's all about love and friendship and being together and accepting the differences and accepting each other for who we are. If we can instill that in our next generations, you know, we'll feel we have done a good job. <laughs>